So right now I will show you exactly how you can add the steps as a widget on your iPhone. Now it's not really that complicated and it's pretty simple to add a widget but the thing is that iPhones with their fitness capabilities don't really allow you to track it that much. Like it's not really the priority of the fitness app on the iPhone I guess. So you cannot really add it to the home screen as the fitness. So I'm going to show it to you right now if you click uh, hold down anywhere you click on the plus icon and just find the fitness widget right here it is this one so you can track your calories all the circles so you have like two views for uh, the um, calories exercise minutes as 10 hours and no steps so that's is kind of annoying for that however what you'll need to do is to open up the app store and look for different apps which can track it there are some apps which i like so for example this one is the first which i've been using in the past you can already tell that there are many of them available some of them even advertising that they have a widget but i personally tried this one you can notice it based on the cloud icon that i already downloaded it so i'm just going to re-download it once again it may ask you for some in-app purchases for more additional features but for some free usage it's going to be okay so you have to at first make sure that the app can access your health data so that's important so i have to click on ok and you can click on get started right now it is tracking your steps the app is fine you can also check out the workouts i mean this is where the premium part gets in but when it comes to that you already have the widget ready so you can just click on that hold down on the screen anywhere go to the all widgets and find the app which we just installed it is this green one right here so you can just add it and you can see right away steps in many different formats details step guide step graph goal competition like circles graphs many different sizes and formats you can see this huge one so yeah this is how you can add it um, you will need to use a third-party app you don't have to use this one as i say but you will need to use one from the app store not the official one from apple but this is basically exactly how you can do it that's the whole process behind it before we wrap up i need to show you this however it is the fox tech educational platform inside there are video editing courses in-depth iphone guides stuff which you may be interested in so definitely go ahead and check it out it's linked down below as of right now hit the thumbs up subscribe to the fox tech and i will see you guys later in the future video